science is always evolving. You know, whether it's medical science, whether it's exercise science, there are always new studies, new information, and that's one of the reasons why we have a process where we're constantly reviewing our content and our programs to make sure that they are changing and growing as new research becomes available. We developed the manuals for a twofold purpose. One is to serve as kind of that, that seminal device for folks who are preparing for the exam, but also to serve as that kind of key reference tool for individuals who are in the profession. Many personal trainers are working with the, a diverse clientele. It, it isn't like a personal trainer is only going to work with one segment. They're going to work with people across the entire spectrum in many cases, so we want to provide them with a tool and a resource that could be applied to that diverse spectrum of individuals they may find themselves working with. Well, the nice thing about the ACE IFT model is that it really is the most comprehensive training model that's available and the reason being is that not only does it address the functional movement and resistance training element which which other models do but it also addresses in a comprehensive fashion the cardiorespiratory component in addition and I think really what is kind of the secret sauce if you will to the ACE IFT model is that it's it's built on the foundation of rapport one of the laments that we hear from a lot of the uh, facility owners and operators is that we have a lot of professionals who come to us who have great deals of knowledge, but they don't know how to communicate with our members. And I think that's one of the unique things about the ACE approach, if you will, is that we really focus on the engagement, on the behavior science side of things, on how do you really uh, connect with folks and so that you can take all that wealth of information you have as a professional and use it to empower someone to change his or her life.